Hey there, history buffs and flag enthusiasts. Welcome back to All About Panama. Today, we're uncovering the fascinating symbolism and history behind Panama's flag. Flags are more than just pieces of cloth. They're symbols of a nation's identity and history. So, grab your magnifying glass, and let's decode the story behind Panama's flag. Thanks for joining us today as we unravel the mysteries of Panama's flag. Let's start by taking a closer look at its design. Panama's flag consists of four rectangles, two white ones, one red and one blue. In the center of each of the white rectangles, you'll find a star, one is red and the other is blue. It's a simple yet striking design, but what does it all mean? Let's dive into the symbolism. Hinting at Panama's connection to the USA, both countries share the colors, red, white and blue. The blue and red are said to represent the conservative and liberal political parties in Panama with both being unified with peace represented by the color white. These two parties historically played significant roles in the country's politics. Now, let's talk about the stars. The stars represents the respective political parties. The two parties have had their share of disagreements, but the stars on the white background signify their peaceful coexistence within the nation. But here's where it gets really interesting. Panama's flag didn't always look like this. In fact, it went through several changes before arriving at the current design. Back in the day, Panama was a part of Colombia, and the flag was the same as Colombia's. But when Panama gained its independence in 1903, it needed its own flag. And that's when the red, white, and blue design was born, made by Maria Asa de Amador. With contributions also ascribed to her son Manuel E. Amador. Here we see a picture of the very first proposal of a flag for Panama designed by the wife of Philippe Jean Bunau Varilla, but it was turned down, due to similarities with the US flag. The current flag has undergone many changes with the quadrants being rearranged. But it officially became what we know today in 1925. And that's when it adopted its current symbolism. Now, let's talk history. Panama's journey to independence was not without its twists and turns. It was a significant player in the construction of the Panama Canal. The US played a role in Panama's fight for independence, and the canal project was a big part of that story. The Panama Canal, one of the most remarkable engineering feats in history, had a profound impact on the nation's development. It boosted Panama's economy and made it a crucial crossroads for international trade. So, when you look at Panama's flag, you're not just seeing colors and shapes, you're witnessing a piece of the country's rich history. It's a symbol of unity, peace, and the unique path Panama has taken on its road to independence. So there you have it, fellow explorers. Panama's flag isn't just a piece of cloth, it's a living symbol of the nation's history, politics, and its pivotal role in the construction of the Panama Canal. If you found this dive into Panama's flag history intriguing, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel, All About Panama, for more exciting insights into the complexities and wonders of this incredible country. Until next time, keep exploring, keep learning, and keep embracing the history of Panama.